beloved viewers. I am Florence Pirolio, together with my partner Nino Aguilar Odang. This is our third video requirement for our subject, Solid Geometry. And we are going to discuss the volume of cylinder. First, we're going to discuss what is a cylinder. What is a cylinder? A cylinder is a prism that has two circles at its bases. Hello, I'm going to present to you the formula for the volume of a cylinder. So here, we have the formula for the volume of a prism, which, which is B, B times H, where B is equal to the area of the base and H is equal to the altitude or the height. So we all know that, we just know that a cylinder is a prism, so we're gonna change. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna derive this formula. So we have here. We're gonna change this prism thing into. So we have here a volume of a cylinder. We all know that the base of a cylinder is the circle, and the formula for obtaining the area of a circle is. Yes, that's right. Pi r squared. So now we have the formula for the volume of a cylinder. Pi r squared, which is equal to the area of the base, which is a circle, times h or the altitude or height. The formula for the area of a circle, pi r squared, pi is equal to the 3.14 something and the r stands for or is equal to the radius of the circle. Again, good day everyone. I am Florence Pirolio. I am here to give an example in finding the volume of a cylinder. So we have here an example of a cylinder. So this cylinder has two bases, which is a circle. So we must first get the measurement of the, the height and the diameter or the radius of this cylinder. So using our ruler. So the diameter of the circle or the base is 4. So to, ha to obtain the radius, we must divide the diameter. So 4 divided by 2 equals 2. So the radius of this base is 2. So we must also get the height of this cylinder. So the height of this cylinder is 6 inches. So to get the volume, we have here, okay. We know that the formula, formula of the cylinder, volume of the cylinder is pi r squared height. So we know that pi is equivalent to 3.14. And we get our radius, with, which is 2, 2 squared, and the height is 6. We must copy this 3.14 and get the square root of 2. The square root of 2 is 4. 4 times 6, which is the, our height. Then 3.14. 4 times 6 is equal to 24, 24. So we have now 3.14 times 24. So we must use our calculators to have no error uh, in calculating it. So 3.14 times 24 is 75, 36, 75.36.
And our unit is inch. Inch chest cube, right? So the so the volume of the cylinder is seventy by point thirty six cubic inches. So that's all, thank you. Hello again. And I'm here to present another exercise for obtaining the volume of a cylinder. Now, we have here, I draw a beautiful drawing, <laughs> just kidding, a beautiful drawing of a cylinder which has the radius of 3 centimeters by its base and the height of 9 centimeters. So, we already know that the formula for the volume of a cylinder is pi r squared times height. Now, pi is equal to 3.14 and the radius 3 over there and then the height 9. So we're going to substitute the values by this. The next step is here. We're going to simplify the squared one. Yeah. So 3 times 3 equals 9. So the values here is now 3.14. 9 and another 9. We're gonna multiply it all and then we're gonna obtain this final volume of 254.34 cubic centimeters. So the volume of this beautiful draw cylinder is 254.34 cubic centimeters.